Well, fans may remember my next guest as the Salvatore brothers on the hit CW show Vampire Diaries. And since then, the two on-screen brothers kept the brotherly bond going with an exciting new project. Ian Summerhalder and Paul Wesley join us now. What's up, gentlemen? You, you are immersed up, in these uh, barrels of whiskey here on the set. This is a personal favorite of mine because I happen to be a fan of this particular spirit. Before we get into it, the two of you played brother vampires for eight years on the Vampire Diaries. Heck of a run right there. Ian, your character lived. Paul, sadly, your character did not. What did you guys think of the ending? Were you happy with it? Um, well, we both wanted to die at the end yeah. of the show. We <laughs> wanted we wanted the brothers to go out with a bang together, um, and we were fighting over who would die. Um, and I ended up getting it. And um, you know, you were a little jealous. You have to admit, you were well, a little jealous. Well, here's the deal. Let's let's redefine define jealousy. Hold on one <laughs> second. So what Paul and I were discussing was is listen. Ultimately, these guys came into town. They destroyed everything. You know, they met Elena, who's a 17-year-old kid. She turned into a killer. She burned down her house. She's like, you know what I mean? I just thought family I just, show. I, right. Yeah. <laughs> I just felt that it was that it was more poetic for these two brothers to go away and then to let these humans sort of resettle back into their town. And but whatever, I lost that. You lost that. <laughs> I lost that. Battle. I hey. lost a lot of battles. <laughs> You guys continue to win, though, because you now have a new bourbon, which, by the way, I am a fan. Uh, I got to tell you, I got a little cocktail right here. Now, for someone, I happen to be familiar, but for someone who has never heard of this particular whiskey before, because not, as you know, not all uh, whiskeys are bourbon, but bourbon is a whiskey. How would you describe it? Well, this is straight bourbon whiskey, right? So it's age minimum of four years. The idea was, was building a bourbon that was approachable right out of the bottle, right? We are firm believers that life kicks you in the teeth. Your bourbon doesn't have to. And <laughs> right out of the bottle, it's smooth enough for someone who doesn't know or even like bourbon and complex enough for, for us who really do love and appreciate bourbon. Yeah. Gentlemen, uh, you're going to show me how to make a particular cocktail. So yeah. let me put this one down. Yeah, man. And let's get right into it. What are we making? So this is called Blood Brothers, right? Okay. So we're going to start with three ounces of um, Brothers Bond. Okay. So, Mario, we're going to get three ounces. We're going to get three ounces in two. there. 0.75 ounces of lemon juice. So there's two of us. So we're going to do like it already. full OZ. Uh, 0.75 um, of uh, simple syrup. So there's two of us, obviously. So we're going to okay. go get it uh, one half. Um, we're going to do some ice in this sucker. Okay, got the ice. So we're gonna get in there. Yeah. Now we're going to shake this happily and vigorously for uh, about 10 seconds. Yeah, baby. Come on, man. There it is, Mario. There it is. There it is. Get a little routine yeah, going. Hey. Little 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 oh. Little. Hey. All right. All right. Now we're gonna strain <laughs> this over there, fresh ice. There we go. There it is. And now, we top now it off. Top it off. We top it off with just a little bit of port wine. Oh. I think it's. Uh, oh, look at that's interesting. That's okay. Got that. Oh, and that's that's the blood. That's and that's the, the blood. blood. That's the blood. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers. Salute. Cheers, Salute, man. gentlemen. Let's see. Cheers, brother. Ooh, that's good. That's good. Not good. Solid drink Not there, delicious. boys. All right. Now that Buddy, we have our drink. drinks, I want to play a little game because it's always fun to play little games oh, when you're yeah. drinking. This is a little game of never have I ever. I will make a statement. If you've done the thing that I mentioned, you drink and tell us what happened. Ready? All right. All right. Never have I ever gone racing with Jay Leno. Cheers. Oh. All right. So here's what happened. So I was on, um, I was pretty young. I just moved into town. I was a young actor and I bought myself, I got my first job and I bought my, immediately bought myself a Mercedes Benz. Um, and yeah, I had wait, no money, yeah, no money you, in the bank. Yeah, you did just, it. Just, he got a check for like $52,000 yeah. and they spent 50 of it on the car. Yeah, and so smart not investment. <laughs> <laughs> um, that's what you do, right? Right. Um, so anyway, I'm on Ventura Boulevard. I'm, I'm with a, uh, there's a girl, I think it was my girlfriend at the time, maybe soon to be girlfriend. And I see this like old vintage Ferrari and I'm like, I got to race that guy because, you know, I want to show off in front of the girl. And I pull up and I'm like, hey, I start honking. I'm like, you lower your window. I'm like, you want to race? 
and the window like slowly goes down and it's Jay Leno. <laughs> and he's like, and he just looks at me and he goes, I'll race you for the girl. And then I was like, all right. And then we, <laughs> we pick off and race. Needless to say, he beat, uh, his Ferrari beat my, uh, oh, my Mercedes. Ferrari. So he yeah, beat right. you in a race yeah. and he took your girlfriend. Great story. And he took me girl. <laughs> I know, I still own him. All right, next know, question, gentlemen. Me. Never have I ever yeah. ended up nude on 60 Minutes. Oh. Oh. Let's hear this. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's so hear this one. Yeah, I was in the fashion business. I was 16. I'm in Milan during the shows. I always did these, like, the women's shows, which is really <laughs> crazy. Because you're so pretty. It's me. I, I don't know about that, but it's usually like 35 naked supermodels running around and about three dudes. And I was wearing a white a Dolce and Gabbana suit and I had black underwear underneath. So this guy comes over to me and says, he screams at me in Italian. He says, You have to take those off. So I took them off. Then, the, right as I took them off, someone needed to steam the pants. So whoosh, there goes my pants, just gone. And so I realized, well, now I'm basically standing here completely naked in this crazy big room. So all of a sudden, I see this 60 minute crew that, with this 60 minute camera and the little thing on it come by and they're shooting everything. And it was pretty wild. So, cut to uh, my girlfriend at the time, her dad sees this. Uh -oh. On 60 Minutes. Those are, pre those are pretty impressive stories back to back. I like it. <laughs> Gentlemen, congratulations <laughs> on the spirit. Ian and Paul, big thank you. And listen, Brothers Bond Bourbon is available online and in stores and select markets starting May 1st. Of course, please drink responsibly.